it's time for skincare. There's a lot of products here. I'm gonna try not to linger on each one for too long. I'm gonna link everything in the description below. So if you want access or information about each particular one, it'll all be linked below for you guys. I'm gonna speak as somebody that is going to be 45 years old in a few days. Skincare is super important and I neglected my skincare for years. I was always big on treatments like uh, chemical peels, microdermabrasion, PRP with microneedling. I, I always did a lot of treatments, but I never had a great skincare routine until the last few years. So I'm going to share with you the products I use. They work for me. They make me happy. They make my skin feel good. That doesn't mean they're gonna necessarily do the same for you, but I'm just here to give you information and what has worked for me. One reoccurring brand you're gonna see a lot throughout my routine is Shiseido. I use their products a lot. I find that they're quality and I really, really enjoy them. I have two routines essentially. They vary like this much. So I have morning and night. A couple products get swapped out. For the most part though, the routine is the same. I'm gonna start with the evening actually because that is the more important routine and I'll explain why. I wear a lot of makeup. I wear makeup usually five to seven days a week and removing that makeup is super important. Leaving your makeup on at night is actually the worst thing you could do for your skin aside from smoking and not wearing sunscreen. But let's not get into that. <laughs> I want to bring you through how I take care of my skin and from step to step to step. So when it's time to just get rid of the beat, I start with makeup for removal. I always use the Shishido Facial Cotton Pads. These are really great because they don't leave those weird little pills, they're lint free, and when you use them, they're not leaving like these little stray bits of cotton wrapped up in your eyelashes. I always find that annoying when I use the regular drugstore cotton rounds. So I switched to these a few years ago. I do love them and I always get them on sale at Ulta because sale. What I do is I use this and along with this, this is the Garnier Micellar Water. This is the all-in-one brightening. This has vitamin C. This is actually, I don't know, my fifth bottle. I just got a refill on this actually with a recent Ulta haul. So I'll use this to remove my eye makeup. That's where I start with my skincare. So I use two of these, one for each eye. I put some micellar water on and then I rest it on my eyes for about 30 seconds and then I smudge away any sort of eyeshadow or mascara that is on my lid and this works well for waterproof mascara as well. I've never had any problems with it taking off really, really stubborn thick mascara, which can happen sometimes with certain products. So moving on, the next thing that I will do is remove my facial makeup and I always use this. This is a Clinique Take the Day Off Balm. This is obviously a well-loved product. Most of it is gone. I'm actually about due for a refill. So what I'll do is I'll take about a finger like a finger swipe size, I pop it on my forehead, and then I'll just blend it into the skin. I stay away from my eyes though. I never ever put this on my eyes because it makes my vision blurry, and it takes a good minute or two before I realized when I would use this on my eye makeup, it would take a minute or two for it to just get out of my eyes, and it actually burned. So I do love this for the skin. I do not recommend this for the eyes. So I'll just massage this all into the face and neck wherever I put makeup. And then to remove that, I use these. These are a must have you guys. So these, it doesn't matter what brand you get, but these are, are the Vuasepi, Vuasepi, I never, I don't know how to say it, but if these are individual towelettes, you guys have seen me mention these. I always have two bags of these. It's textured on one side and flat on the other, you know, um, you know, not, not textured. And I'll use two of these during my skincare routine. Firstly, when I'm removing this facial balm, I will rub it off. I'll remove it with this little towelette and they're just one use disposable towelettes. So I'll remove the facial balm with this, then I'll wet my face and I'll start washing my face. I do not rinse this off my face. I just don't, it gets in my eyes and it drives me absolutely crazy. When I'm washing my skin, something, something is very important that I have to talk to you guys about. It's these. We need to talk about these. I got a pair of these as a present for Christmas and when I tell you they changed my life, I have this weird thing that when I wash my face and water goes down my arms, it, it, it drives me crazy. I don't want to say the word triggered, but it, it just, I, I can't deal with it. So you put these on when you're washing your face like this, right? And when you're washing your face, 
and you're splashing the water, the water doesn't drip down your arms. These have changed my life. I'm not even kidding. It has changed my life. And then when I take them off, when I'm done washing, I just squeeze them out. I have about, I don't know, 14 or 15 of these. I'll probably use them, I don't know, two or three times. And then I throw them in the wash because I just squeeze the water out and I, I toss them back on my sink. I have these little hooks that I just dry them on. So if you want to only use them once, you can do them once. I'm not judging you, but don't judge me. I do use them two or three times. I use them for two days. So I'll use them four times and then I just, I put them back. You know, I put them in the wash. These changed my life. I'm telling you they changed my life. I hated washing my face because I hated the water running down my arms. There's something about it that it makes me feel so uncomfortable. The cheapest solution to the most annoying problem in my facial skincare routine. Then when I move on to washing my face, there's a few things to note here about that. I use two different facial cleansers and this is where my morning to night kind of shifts a little bit. So in the morning I always use this. This is the Shiseido Deep Cleansing Foam. So in the shower, first thing in the morning, this is the facial cleanser that I use. It's gentle. It gets just like the sleep off your face. It just rejuvenates your face and I, I, I love this one. But this one's the real star of the show. This is Shiseido again. It's the clarifying cleansing foam. So when I've worn a full face of makeup all day, usually at least 12 plus hours, I'm using this. Any remnant that, that, that the bomb has left, this gets off my skin. So I just massage it onto my face for about a minute, a minute, maybe a minute and a half. Doing a face wash for like 30 seconds is not enough. You have to do it for at least a minute. And what I use is one of these little bad boys. So this, it goes on your hand like this. I got these I don't know, I feel like I got a 12 pack of them from Amazon. It's just these little textured pads and uh, you slip them on your fingers and then I put my facial wash right on there and then I just gently scrub. If you have something like a Foreo, it's the same kind of concept. This is a hell of a lot cheaper and you don't have to uh, charge this up. So I massage it into my face to take off all just the excess. I have a lot of large pores. This helps get you know into the large pores because these tiny little nubbins right on there. So I use this when I'm cleansing my face. Uh, this is not meant to exfoliate. So I just want to say that this is very soft as silicone and it's just helped to aid. I don't use it all the time. Um, I'd be lying if I said I did. Sometimes I just want to go in and just wash my face quick because this doesn't exactly stay on your hands very well. I wind up like scrunching it this way and using it. So sometimes this gets a little annoying, but I find it's a very great tool. Twice a week I will exfoliate. You have to be gentle with exfoliation because you can cause more damage than good. You could break, break little uh, blood vessels on your skin, little capillaries, cause those little tiny itty bitty little vessels around the nose. You have to be careful with exfoliation. So I do it about twice a week, maybe even sometimes just once a week. There are a ton of exfoliants out there. I'm going to show you what I use. I use a chemical one and I use a physical one. I know it's not super easy to get necessarily, but I love the Mary Kay Time Wise. I had a patient years ago that was a rep for Mary Kay and I had told her, oh, I love Mary Kay. I love their microdermabrasion. She says, I'll get you some. So she got me some. <laughs> I absolutely love this. I have to track it down every time I need it now. It lasts a long time. It looks like a cream, but it has these tiny itty bitty finest little bits of, of, of sand. It feels like sand, but it's not sand. Just these little tiny bits in there. My skin tends to get dry and kind of like scaly and flaky. I say I call it crusty dusty, so especially around my chin and my forehead. So I do have to exfoliate with something like this. I have to manually just get out the, the gunk. So I will use this. I love, 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 love it. I am going to link everything below for you guys, including this. So good. I love this. Time wise, I've been using this for years, years. I fell off of Mary Kay, off this product for a while because I couldn't find it anywhere. And then I found it again and I haven't left since. So before I put on my toner, I will use face masks on occasion. Usually like, I don't know, once or twice a month. I discovered this one from Benefit, this product. So good. This is called the Professional Deep Retreat Pore Cleansing Clay Mask. I had gotten the little travel size. I used it about five times and that was it. It just, the hydration. It is this dark purple. I love the way they play the packaging into the color of the product. I put a generous helping of this on my skin. I leave it until it dries and then I take it off when I rinse it off my face. My face is so moisturized. It, <laughs> oh, 
So when I'm feeling just a little run down, a little bit dry, a little scaly, flaky, dusty, crusty, dusty, I will put this on. It just, it's, it's absolutely amazing. Let me just read to you what it says. It says apply to even dry face, neck weekly. Leave on for 30 minutes until, or until dry. The dots appear when the oil is drawn out of the pores and rinse. I don't use it weekly, maybe twice a month, but the product is stellar and worth the investment. One thing I really like about it is you can buy the little small one and you don't have to get the big one. If you, especially if money is tight but you want to try the product, you can try it out. You know, you could probably even go to Ulta and get a sample of it, honestly, have them make you a little sample. I don't see why they wouldn't. It is amazing and you need a good mask in your, in your life. Um, it's really important to help lock in that moisture and it's really nice to just kind of sit there with the mask on your face honestly you just sit there you're quiet I scroll through TikTok I hang out with myself while meds at work and I have a good time just drying out the pores and my skin looks like like shiny liquid plastic almost when I take it off it is so good so the next products I want to talk about are the Paula's Choice Toners. I'm a huge proponent of these. Again, different from morning and night. So the, this one, actually, I think I have maybe like two applications of this left. This is the Resist uh, Advanced Replenish Toner. It's got hyaluronic acid. It's great for rejuvenating the skin and making it feel plump. It stimulates collagen. This is going to, this is going to be more moisturizing. So in the beginning of the day, after I get out of the shower, I use this after I cleanse. This is the toner I use. You can either put it onto a cotton round or, you know, my little cotton squares, or you can put it right in your hands. For me, I like to just put it right in my hands. I feel like it wastes less product. I put two drops right in my hands. You'll see it in the little video I insert, and then I just smooth it all over my face. At night, same thing as the clarifying wash. I'll use this. This is the BHA 2% uh, liquid exfoliant. I will use this at night just to take kind of the day off, just to rejuvenate my skin after a long day. So this is my nighttime toner, this is my daytime toner. These two things, mm. I did a video on this product, I wanna say seven, eight years ago. I've loved this for a long time. I've always been a big fan of Polish Choice and their products are awesome. Next is serum time. I'll move to the Shiseido Ultimate Power Infusing Concentrate. I remember getting a sample of this years and years ago. And it was before I could really spend any significant money on skincare. Now I'm older, for me, investing in good skincare is, is important to me. That's what I like to spend my money on. This serum is delicious. I just put two pumps and I smooth it all over my face. It gives my face just this dewy, fresh feeling. I use this twice a day, morning and night two pumps and I do go down my neck with it. Serums really help just seal in that moisture. I love this. It's a, a beautiful, repairing, delicious serum. Again, huge fan. So next is moisturizer. So this face cream I use morning and night. This is the hydrating cream. Uh, this has also hyaluronic acid in it and this is essential energy. That's <laughs> the Shiseido Essential Energy. I don't love a heavy moisturizer. This goes on my skin, it absorbs right in, and it doesn't give me that thick, creamy feeling. It plumps up my skin, it makes me look very, very hydrated, and I've never had any issues with this moisturizer, just pilling or getting yucky underneath my makeup. I really recommend this. I have gone through so many of these at this point. At one point, I also got the Benefits Wrinkle Smoothing Cream from Shiseido. I had gotten a bunch of like Christmas, you know, when you buy one, they, they give you a bunch of products free. So I, I wound up getting this one. This is another daily moisturizer. This one's a little bit thicker. So if I'm feeling excessively dry, a lot of times when I go to Florida or I spend time in the sun, I will go for this at the nighttime because this is a little bit thicker than this. I feel like if I really need that bump in moisture, I will go for this. Again, this is the, the Benefiance Wrinkle Smoothing Cream Enriched by Shiseido. So both of these are really good. This is my everyday though. I reach for this every day, twice a day. This is every once in a while when I'm feeling exceptionally just dehydrated. As far as under eye creams go, 
Now, when you're a woman of a certain age, or you're a woman in general, sometimes you need to think about an eye cream. I never wanted to think about an eye cream. It doesn't matter how much Botox you get, those wrinkles under the eyes will not go away. When we get older, our under eyes, gets very, they get very dry, and the fine lines just, they stick around. So you have to invest in a good eye cream. This is the uh, Benefiance Wrinkle Smoothing Eye Cream by Shiseido. You need the tiniest amount of this. When I tell you I've had this since December, look, I still have like months worth of cream. It's so thick, and when I tell you, you'll see in the video, I put a tiny little drop. It hydrates my under eyes. I focus it all around my orbital rim. So all the way up to the eyebrow, all around the eye, the eye socket. I love this product and I feel like it sticks in place. It doesn't like absorb immediately into the skin. It just, it hangs out there. It's almost like this eye mask and it creates this barrier that just protects all night long, all night long. But I do use this twice a day, by the way. Next, I wanna to talk to you about something so, so important. Not that all this wasn't important. This is one of the most telling signs for women when it comes to showing our age and this is our neck and decollete area. I discovered this on a TikTok ad. This is the Go Pure Tighten and Lift Neck Cream. This is my fourth jar. I am obsessed with this stuff. I realized, uh, I, I wanna say about two years ago, that I started getting these kind of lines around my neck, and sometimes I would get this almost like crepey skin right here in my decollete area. I am so self-conscious about it, and I really started going through neck creams to see what I liked. It wasn't until I found Go Pure that my life changed. It is the most luxurious cream. Honestly, I barely have any left in this one. You saw, you see me in the video here, I'm going like this. I'm tapping it, I'm tapping it, because I have long fingernails, and for me to get underneath, like I get it underneath my nails, drives me crazy. Yes, I have a little a spatula, I don't use it. I, I don't know why. The special always gets lost. It's in my bathroom. It just, it, it vanishes. So I tap it on its side. I take some out and I put it from right from my my chin all the way down to almost, almost my breast area. So I just, I, all this, all this, this cream, this cream is just life changing. This cream visibly reduced the look of my wrinkles and my crepey skin. This, the crepiness here the last thing I wanted to do was walk around and see crepey skin here. That drove me absolutely insane. And I've had a noticeable increase in firmness, especially in this area and in my neck. And as you'll see in my video, I do like a little faux gua sha on myself, a little hand gua sha, to kind of help the lymphatic uh, drainage of this area to keep the extra fluid out of here. And this product, mm, oh, if you guys, need to get one product out of all the products I have talked about, this is the one. Full disclosure, a little over a month ago, Go Pure reached out to me. They wanted to send me this product. I was beyond excited. Now this isn't a sponsored video, so don't think it is. But they reached out to me and they're like, hey, do you wanna talk about you know one of our products in one of your videos? We'd like to send it to you for free if you'd like to try it out. And I was like, uh, hell yes, I already use it, send me all the free products. They sent me one, let's not get crazy. But I was happy, happy to talk about it in this video because I already use it, I've been using it, I've been using it for two years, I am a huge fan of it, and I tell everybody about this product. I love, 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 love it. And for me, seeing such a huge difference in the texture and the, the just like the look of my neck and, and dex area, I talk about it all the time. I, I just, I cannot share this information enough to the people that I care about because it was a point of self-consciousness for me and I know if I feel that way, other people feel that way too. So that's it guys. That is my huge skincare routine. I know it varies a little from morning to night. I will link all the products down in the description for you guys. If you wanna click them, it's easy to buy. You just click and buy. Most of these are available at Ulta, the Polish choice you can only get at Sephora, and this you have to get online, which I will provide a link. If I have a coupon code, I'm going to put that next to the link as well. That's all I've got to say. I hope this was helpful for you guys. If you have any of the products that I've spoken about and you use them, please let me know. If you have any questions, 
There's an email attached to my Instagram. You can always send me an email. You can send me a DM on Instagram. I'm always responding. I love hearing from you guys. It means a lot, our interactions. It's, it's so important to me. So if you have any questions or concerns, please reach out to me personally. And that's it for this video. All right, later.